Just within the last hour, we have learned that a Vermont State Police Trooper was involved in a simply awful crash that shut down I-89 northbound in Bethel this morning. Thanks for being with us at noon. I'm Jack Thurston. Now we are still learning more information about that situation in Bethel, but we have a live crew on the scene working the situation for us. John Hawks now. John, what can you tell us about maybe the trooper's condition or what led up to this? Yeah, Jack, that's right. I'm standing right here on the northbound side of I-89. I'm around exit, uh, the just past exit three, mile marker 23. I'm going to step out of the way so you can kind of see what we're working with right now. So right now there's a fire truck. Um, that's the Bethel fire truck um, that was on the scene. They have already cleared the Vermont State Troopers cruiser. But basically Vermont State Police is telling us around 8.30 a.m. a trooper was responding to an accident in the northbound lanes just north of the Bethel, Bethel exit. That's when they say the cruiser hit a fire truck that was stopped on the highway already on the scene of the crash and where a box truck was already overturned in the medium a tenth of the mile farther north. Vermont State's trooper's name has not been released. We're told that, we're told that they are in critical condition and were airlifted to Dartmouth-Hitchcock Medical Center in Lebanon. Officials have been on scene investigating all morning. Interstate 89 starting at exit 3 is still closed northbound and there are no delays southbound. Crews have been working all morning to investigate and have worked to clear the scene. We'll have more coming up at 4. And for now, live in Bethel, John Hawks, NBC5 News. Back to you.